picture. And I just, I just want to know how you, come you, you keep opening? Do you live here? Only for eight years now. I've only had this conversation with you five times. Yeah. Five times in eight years I've had this conversation with you. Why are they closed? They are closed because the subdivision has said they will be closed for the, so that it's an empty. And did you go to the meeting? That, did you go hey, to the subdivision meet, meeting? You just answered the question. So why are you stopping me and asking me why I'm opening and closing the gates? Because I want to know okay. why you just You just said why. You, you just said why. You just said why. Because for now, the subdivision is closing the gates. They have been closed <laughs> for 30 years. Then why are you asking me why I'm closing the gates? I'm asking you why you're going through them, opening and closing them. Look, like the four conversations we've had before, yeah. them are Mike. Romans gates, okay? They aren't the subdivision no, gates. They are not your gates, okay? Are Romans, they are Romans. He, she knows this. She knows this. Karen knows this. She knows this. Karen, you live right there. Go home. Go, no, go go home. Go home. I want to know what makes you so special to jump in front of people's cars and make them stop. I walk carefully. That was nice. No, she's done this five times, dude. Okay. Five different times. Look, look, you've done it, okay? Because with the people that used to live over there in that condo that Mike was renting to, you freaking followed us all the way from the gates when you jumped in front of the car like you're doing now over to their house. Over to their house, you was on their front porch screaming, yelling, and hollering about some people trespassing. They're not allowed in this private Oh, my Lord. what needs to happen is just that thing to be put back there. Yeah, well, I want to take a picture of this bike Well, take a picture. You want me to get in front of it and smile for you? Pardon me? You want me to get in front of it and smile for you? My husband's a retired well, he, he can tell you I live at 905 Lakeland, okay? <laughs> I know that we want to do a formal complaint because if you notice, it says no private trespass. property, no... Are you no guys like oblivious to, to this vehicle? Are you like not aware that this vehicle has been in here for 10 years almost? I know your vehicle. I mean, come on. I do know. Why I know what you drive. So I know what you drive. Okay. I know what most people drive because I see most people's vehicles all the time in here. Well, no, that's because it's not your property to go through. <laughs> hey, I gotta go. I got kids coming home. I need to get home. So can you take your picture and move your, move your, move your butt out of the street so we can drive on the street? Well, you're acting like a damn Karen, so I'm gonna call you Karen. It's, 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 Move. You need to get out. You need to move. You need to get the fuck out of the street now. You need to move out of the road. Out of the road. This is for cars. Remember my fucking nephew who was riding his dirt bike and you fucking carried out and you carried out on him and tried to yank him off his bike and then you took his thousand dollars phone and threw it on the ground? Do you remember that too? Because I remember that about your crazy ass too. He was 16 years old. He ain't no little liar, okay? We saw his phone. His li his phone was destroyed. You fucking threw his phone. Let me guess. He did that on his own and decided he wanted to blame you. Okay, you need to move before I call the police. I'm going to call the police and have them take your ass to your home so you can take your meds and, and go on about your day and leave people alone. 
you're the fucking crazy one standing in front of my car, not moving, now that you know who I am. Thank you. Alright, alright, this, this lady, I'm this lady, she's been all one since we've been here. I wouldn't want to live with, I would is not permanently, son, I would not permanently want to live with people is like you. I yet? got the option to get the hell out of here and it's going to happen. I feel oh, sorry please, for people who own homes in here please that have to out. live with you. At out. least I got the option please to get, get the out. hell out of here. Please Wait for your out. crazy please. ass. White trash. Please <laughs> get out like that. What trash. the fuck is your problem now? No problem other than your fuck, 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 fuck so shit. Ignorant. And now wait a minute. Now wait a minute. So What's your issue now? Hold on. We got a we got a Karen. We got a Karen and a Kevin. This must be her brother you Kevin. Go away now, bud. This must be brother Kevin because I haven't even done or said anything to you. Well, then obviously you. And now you're, you're saying delusional. that you wish I fucking would because I'm a Remember, fucking asshole. You had your truck in the middle of the road and your trailer, and you were throwing gravel in the road, and you prevented me from going around you. I was throwing gravel in the road. Oh, he doesn't. You mean I was numbers. putting gravel down at the gate that you think you own and that you I have rights to? Your truck was impeding when it's my Mike's driving. and it's not yours. Just go away. Just go so away. now you do know. So go so so there. okay. This was all that just a big ass act, ass right? This was all just, just a big ass away. show. Just you just, away. you guys are lonely, bored, and need each other to start shit Mike, with people. I, Would you please I ask see Mike your who came? I, I know, is, right? Wah, wah, wah. Well, that's because you're standing next to Karen here. No, no, I, I would think right that way you, too. Boy, so I, I would think that way too if I had a Karen on my side. No I'd be yourself. like, woo! What am I gonna do today with the rest of myself? Well, I'm gonna start well, shit with people. The whole trip, she put in my seat. You no, you seen it. it. No, she didn't. She put, no. I'm allowed to put my seat back. I'm allowed to put my seat back. I'm allowed to put my seat back. Hello, bro. What did I do? Hello. Bro, what the fuck? You can get away from our car. I'm not opening the door. She can hear me perfectly fine. I can't hear you. She can hear me perfectly fine. Hear Bro, please can you come back? Can you please come back? I don't know why you left me. Can you please come back? Uh, yeah, you did. Y'all see, y'all see why. Taken away from me because of you. Because of me. me So, this is in Montclair. This time, she just took it off. 
Dude, I don't want to be on What's, the internet. Please don't kill me. Dude, Why'd you take it off then? I'm asking Fuck you off. to go away, please. Why'd you take it off for? Because it doesn't need to be there. Thank Why? you. You can go away now, please. Why are you taking it off for? You, know, you took it off? You're you're proud about taking it off? Thank you. Why'd you take it off for? Please I'm go not going anywhere until you answer my question. Please go away. So why'd you take the sign off? It's right here. There's no reason to be taking it off. It doesn't bother you. So why are you taking the sign off for? Please go away. What's, what was your issue with the sign? I don't want to talk to you. I would like you to go away, please. So do you have a problem with people who are abducted by Hamas? Dude, fuck off. I need you to go away, please. I'm just asking you why you took it I have asked you, you several times to go to away. Please so go. go the fuck away. I'm not going go. away. We have asked you several times, very politely, to go away. It's so leave. It's not polite to take down the sign. It's not polite to stand here and film us when we're asking you not to. So fuck off. Dude, I'm not going to. Please leave us alone. So why'd you take it off for? You're not going to go away? We tell you you're not going to go away if we don't tell you. Fuck off. Why'd you take off the sign? You're acting like a child. We're asking you to leave. I don't want to talk to you. I especially so don't want to be filming So why did you take the sign me. off? What was wrong with the sign? Are you waiting here all day to bother people? I why need you, you take, to go away. Why did you take the sign off for? So you're okay eating bagels, which is from the Jewish culture but you're not okay with a vigil for people who are abducted by Hamas. Dude, dude please leave us alone. Please leave us I alone. Don't, I don't, I don't so want to talk times. to you, what? please. Can you just... Am I asking who you are? What? Why are you... Can Why? You who filming? who are like, you? I, I and who are you? I'm just someone who doesn't like the fact that you're bothering people. For Would you know what happened here? What happened here? They're literally eating bagels. What okay, so go mind your business. Go mind your business. You're not minding your fucking business. You're not minding your fucking business. Can you fuck off, please? Is there a problem? Why don't we just both walk away? No, we're not walking away. Why there was not? a sign here about a vigil for those who are abducted by Hamas, and she just took that off for no reason. It's not bothering her. People can take flyers down. No, like, for what reason? What is the issue with that? What is the issue with that? That is not that big of a deal. You okay, don't have to then go leave it. It's not a big deal for, for me. It's a big deal. Okay, well, I'm sorry that you're having a bad day, and I apologize to you. You're apologizing to them for not, taking down the sign about a vigil about those who are abducted by Hamas. So you're apologizing to them. Have a great day. I, I think you should leave them alone. That's nice. Thank you. So, why did you take the sign off for? I don't want to talk to you. It's my why did this sign buddy, bother you? I saw fuck you. Fuck off. We're telling you to go away. Can I'm you fuck leaving. off, please? I'm not fuck leaving. off. I'm not leaving. Go away. It's I'm like, not going it's to not leave. your business. It's not my business. I am Jewish and I'm putting the signs up. You see these signs here? These are signs that I'm putting up. So you just took down the sign that I'm so putting up. So put up another one if you want to. No, I'm asking you why you took it down. I'm so going to put up another one for sure. Put up another one I'm, just asking, just I'm just asking you why you took it down. You're very proud to take it down. I saw you from over there. You crumpled it up. You're very proud about it. And now that you're sitting down here, you don't have an explanation for your actions. So I'm just asking you a question why you took it down. What you're trying to do is to say that I'm doing something disrespectful. I didn't like I'm asking you why you took the sign. I'm not, Look, I'm not buddy, saying I'm anything Jewish about too, whether... And there ain't nothing more anti-Semitic than Zionism. Like you're, you're... Fuck off. So why did you take the sign off? I just told you why we took it off. I'm asking you why you took it off. Please stop recording me. You're gonna put it on the internet somewhere and you're gonna fucking claim that you're the one in the right. I'm just asking and you you're being an asshole off. right now to two you people who are not fucking so you can't. You can't respond. I just did. Okay. Two of those would be a telegram, right? Nobody knows what a telegram is anymore because we don't use them. Um, Who just did that? No, I want to know. Stand up. We'll stay here until either that person admits who it is or the person sitting around them tells me who it is. Who was it? Nobody knows? It was back here? I've been hearing it in this room, like, regularly. And I'm not sure I believe that.
Let me tell you something, you guys. My bad side is as bad as my pleasant side is pleasant. All right? Don't push me that way. I like to keep things informal in here as much as possible, but understand where the difference between informal and impolite is. And I won't tolerate impolite. If I hear one more of these overly loud yawns, get up and walk the hell out. Yawn outside. Stay out of class. Whatever it is you need to do to get over it. I want to know why 220 other people in this room don't find the need to do that. And you should be asking yourself, why am I the one loser that has to do that and 220 other people know better? Don't push me to this point again. All right. Now, if that didn't ruin the tone for the rest of the class, by the way, if somebody wants to anonymously tell me who it is, please do. All right? A kilobyte. <laughs>